Let's have a look at Coinbase technicals from here. Stock is down 6% today due to BTC coming down as well. So Bitcoin is down 7% and all the BTC related stocks are down significantly as well. There's Mara, Riot, CI, uh, a lot of stocks, um, crypto names are down today. So what to watch from here? So if you are looking at this chart, so recent highs for Coinbase 370. So as a downtrend, so stock is downtrending for the past two months, I'm watching this trend line, all right? So looks like yesterday we hit this 280. That was the pivotal point for this stock to break downtrend. And now today, uh, like touch this 260 as a support. That's what I'm watching and right below 245. All right, these are the two support levels. And if it tries to bounce, I'm gonna watch at this level, this trend line as a resistance as well. And if it does break out, and that's my breakout. So if it does break out 280, and then next resistance would be $300 for this stock. But just be uh, cautious with BTC as well. If BTC um, goes lower, uh, and if it does break below 45, looks like Bitcoin at the moment is 47,600, 700. So if it does break 45,000, uh, 45, the next support for BTC is around 41,000. So yeah, keep that in mind when you're trading these crypto related stocks because they tend to move together uh, with a little bit of a lag, but they, they, they follow each other. So. What else uh, to watch for Coinbase? Volume is low, end of the year. Uh, if you look at um, uh, MACD, it was showing that we have a bullish crossover. So it could be just the pullback before it tries to push higher. Because if you look at the past one, two, three, four, five, six days, uh, Coinbase had sort of a Christmas rally and it could be just uh, uh, profit taking or it could be just uh, pullback uh, before it tries to um, go higher from here but again you need to wait for the confirmation uh, if i look at the option activity today not much of a volume traded pretty much put to call ratio is the same and also if you look at the let's take a look at february 18th and say what's the probability of uh, what's the market is pricing option market is pricing for coinbase um, to move so by February 18th, uh, implied volatility 670% for that particular uh, month. And um, February 18th, $56, uh, pretty much that's what it's implying. And if I look at $350 strike price for Coinbase, well, there is 10% probability that Coinbase may be trading around $350 by uh, February 18th. All right, and also, what about $200? Let's say, I'm, I think that the stock can be trading around $200. Well, the probability of that is 19%. So puts looks like a little bit more expensive than buying calls. Even though I didn't go out uh, too much, like I don't, I'm not looking at $100 move up or down. So let's say, okay, so two, 260 at the moment, uh, let's say two, th $360 move, 8%. What about from here, 160, 8%. So pretty much same, okay, yeah. Not too big of a difference, but if you are closer to the money, looks like hedging your position looks like slightly more expensive. And implied volatility of a 70% is usually um, a bit higher for me but uh, careful if you're trading options, all right? So also keep in mind uh, uh, that stock has a lot of support at these, if you look at the volume profile at these levels of uh, 245 and also 230, 235, and even right here at 260s, it has a support. So um, look at this volume profile. And then from here, from 260 all the way till 300, doesn't have too much of a resistance, but it needs to get above this trend line because this sell-off was pretty big sell-off. And let's measure this sell-off. How much did it drop? 36% drop. And at the moment, 
from its recent highs, stock is down 28%. So careful with, with this name, all right? Um, that's what I'm watching for Coinbase. Uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.